Welcome to B Today 15. Whoa. We're, we're just flying right along. I plan on sleeping in tomorrow. That's my plan. You guys like my microphone? <laughs> I made that. It goes it goes like this. Pretty cool, right? I guess I could just do that. We're cruising right along. I'm wearing the shirt that I made in that one video a little back there. I'm not too thrilled with the way the shirt turned out. It looks like a freaking muscle man in this bad boy. It's so tiny. <sighs> yeah. Today I want to talk about the creative process. The biggest obstacle for most creatives is just getting started. That's the hardest part for most creatives. So how do you overcome this obstacle? There's, there's a lot of different ways to do this, but one of the most effective ways that I've found is to create if-then statements. So for example, my if-then statement that I use to make sure that I at least make some music every single day is to say something like, if I wake up, then I play one note. So for the if portion of it, you want it to be something you do every single day. Something that's gonna be consistent throughout your life. If I wake up, if I brush my teeth, if I eat breakfast, these are things that you're gonna do every single day. Things like if I go to work isn't, isn't gonna be as effective because it's not something that you do every single day. So you want it to be something that's done every single day. And then for the then portion of this, you want it to be something super simple like the least amount that you could possibly do so for me play one note it's super easy to do I'll typically do way more than that the point is to make it as simple as possible so that you're not discouraged from doing it every single day so even if I only play one note I've accomplished what I was trying to do for the day. You'll find that not only is this creating healthy habits, but it's also taking the pressure off of me to create something amazing because I'm now creating an abundance of ideas now. You know, I'm coming in every day and I'm doing something. So I have a lot to work with. So I'm not feeling this pressure of like, oh, it's gotta be good. I can let go of that and just kind of take more risks and have fun with it, you know? You can apply it to almost anything in your life and you'll always have time to do the things that you want to do as well.
properly in doing it, in figuring it out for yourself and making the music. going to have to do this anyway so why not cut to the chase and figure out how you're going to sit down and write music right now even if you're a complete beginner because you're going to have to do it anyway so i hope that you guys find a way to take more risks and have a little bit more fun with your creative endeavors whatever it may be building mattresses or making train wheels can you hear the train all right anyway don't forget to like subscribe uh share comment catch you guys on the flippity flop peace